we are here uh, to attend the workshop on the Power Lab. It's a very recent and advanced uh, module for the research purposes in the field of medicine and the physiology. And uh, we are here especially for the neurophysiology session. And uh, this uh, Power Lab is actually the software and the hardware component. And you can record uh, the research data here. You can present it, you can uh, manipulate it, and you can uh, then uh, use it for your uh, research purposes. Uh, it was uh, indeed a very nice and pleasant experience, and uh, it was very well conducted. Basically, we use uh, conventional uh, chymograph for the muscle studies. Now this is the advancement in physiology. So we learned a new technology in physiology and uh, it, we learned today uh, how to do muscle conduction studies, uh, EMGs and EEGs, uh, which can be both uses for research purposes and for diagnostic and for treatment purposes. Uh, so it, is, it was all a very nice and a healthy activity. This is the second workshop I am attending there in IMDC on Power Lab. We are introducing some Power Lab experiments. EMG and evoked EMG we are already being doing in USRA Medical College. But there are certain experiments which we wanted to induce. For this I came here so that I had hands-on training, especially this uh, practicals regarding the muscle fatigue tetanization and uh, summation. I had some background knowledge but the new information was that it was it is very easy for the students to equip and to adjust with the power lab rather than they become when they become scary with the animals although animal handling sh they sh should also be known to the students but sometimes due to lack of availability and due to some season the frogs and they are not available and they can have the same experiments on the power lab which is most uh, easy for them. I am very thankful to uh, Dr. Majid and this whole uh, setup, the IMDC, because they, it is actually the demand of the time that we are um, actually implementing this power lab in our laboratory setups as well. They are very much beneficial because um, whenever our students go abroad, they have no idea how to do all this muscle to aid this summation, tetanization. We use very conventional, the frog type and the chymograph things. This is the new advanced technology and they will have a good idea and actually the real idea of these experiments taking on, on uh, the human body and the muscle twitch and the summation on human muscles. So uh, in uh, research for research purposes and clinical setups as well, our students will have a very good perspective of these experiments. This is my second workshop here. This is the continuation of the first workshop. So I am uh, happy that uh, I did get something to teach my students the new things. In basics, uh, uh, you know, it's very rare to conduct such academic activities, uh, but I am very pleased uh, to attend this uh, very much positive and healthy, very informative activity. IMDC ki khas baat ye hai ki agar hands-on training hoti hai, to ye waqi hands-on training karate hai. Ye nahi hai ki sirf hum unka lecture sun le, demonstration dekh le, aur phir we go back aur khud se. Yahan pe they make sure ki aap ko wo ek do dafa apne hathon se khud karwa le, taaki koi confusion hai, koi baat hai, koi chiz hai, pooch le. Jo mujhe pehle कुछ आइडिया हो गया था पावर लैब का वी वेंट बैक टू द कॉलेज हमने खुद से किया लेकिन दो तीन कंफ्यूजन्स थे आज वो भी क्लियर हो गई हैं वी आर मूविंग टुवर्ड्स अ बेटर फ्यूचर फिजियोलॉजी में इनोवेशंस हैं नई पावर लैब इंट्रोड्यूस कराई है इन्होंने तो इसके बारे में ये बार बार हमें बुला के सिखा रहे हैं तो अगर हमें सिखाएंगे तो हम अपने स्टूडेंट्स को सिखाएंगे मुझे ये लगता है कि इस तरह की वर्कशॉप्स अगर होती रहेंगी सो यू गेट टू नो द न्यू थिंग्स एंड देन यू गेट टू नो द फिजियोलॉजिस्ट ऑफ इस्लामाबाद एंड पिंडी आप इंटरेक्ट भी करते हो आप बहुत कुछ सीखते हो और फिर यू वॉन्ट टू गेट नो मोर